By using this fix, I was able to reduce the Hogwarts Legacy VRAM requirement from 7300 MBs to 5650 megabytes. That's nearly 2 gigabytes of VRAM requirements reduced. The game feels much more smoother now as you can see and here is the proof. Lags and stutters are all gone from the game now. It's as smooth as it should be. To apply the fix, you need to visit this particular file which is located in, in C drive. Your username, app data, local, Hogwarts legacy, saved, config and then windows no editor. In that engine.inf file will be there. You need to create a copy of this file just in case anything goes wrong and then right click on it and select edit. This will open the file in the notepad. Then move towards the end of the file and paste these settings. I will provide these settings in the description. Now let me tell you the major settings that you need to edit in these are the first two ones. The first setting r.streaming.pool size equal to whatever value. This particular setting is responsible for reducing the VRAM requirement. But it doesn't comes without its own flaw. If you reduce this setting by a huge margin, then you will see that your textures are getting compressed and they are not the same as they used to be. Right. So you need to find the sweet spot for your particular graphic card. If you have a 8 GB card, then the recommended setting for the 8 GB card is 4096 MB. Basically half of the video memory of the card, but we are going to set it really low so that this particular memory leak of this game doesn't affect our performance. And I will not advise to go below 1024 megabytes. These values are in megabytes, right? Because I have seen the textures changing myself. So experiment with these settings 1024 to 2048 megabyte of the value is good enough to reduce the lag spike and to maintain the integrity of textures. Second thing r.streaming.frames for full update equal to a particular setting. Setting this setting to too low, which the game does by default causes the texture to stream immediately. And that causes the small stutter. So the stutter fix is the hero of our video is this particular setting. Setting this to too high, like a uh, high would be to about 20 setting will cause this textures to stream so slow that you will be able to feel that okay, a particular texture is missing. Here is how it looks like if you set it to too high. In my case, I set to 200 and texture never loaded. So keeping it to about zero, oh no, one <laughs> to uh, between one to 20 would be fine. Again, experiment according to your needs. That's it. Let me know in the comment section which setting works best for your case. My name is Rohit Joshi from Indie One Up, and I will catch you in the next video. And you guys, don't forget to subscribe and like the video. Thank you.